Fora TV. The world is thinking. I think it's interesting to think about the history of the interracial marriage cases and the gay marriage problem today. Because in the, in the, in the Loving case, California in 1948 declared the interracial marriages uh, to be allowed. It took from 1948 to 1967, uh, 18 years, for the Supreme Court to, uh, to allow interracial marriages. Now, Massachusetts has allowed gay marriages in 2004. I don't think it's going to take 18 years to uh, legalize it in the country. For one reason, I think the younger generation, the Obama generation, so to speak, doesn't consider gay marriage as a big issue. It's not a big deal. Uh, I think they think that this country is, is ready for, well, they're ready for an African-American president. They can be ready for uh, gay, gay same-sex marriages. Uh, you did, have a, did the Loving case become a political issue in the 68 campaign? Or either, I mean, was there a political backlash in these 20 states against the Warren Court's decision as there were in so many of the Warren Court decisions? There was, there was a lot of talk, but it didn't really, and a lot of those states refused to change their law. They left them on the books for 30 more years, South Carolina and North Carolina. But once the court, once the court spoke, uh, it pretty much was accepted. Even though in, in 67 there were 19 or 20 states you, you could not get married in. Obama's parents got married in 1961 and had to go to a state, not Hawaii, where they, uh, I forgot what state they got married in, where, where it was legal. And what was the Palmari uh, case? Palmari was a case where, in 1984, where a woman uh, and a, uh, two white Caucasians, a man and wife, divorced, and they gave child custody to, to the a woman, the, the mother. She then married a black man, and the husband sought to take away custody on the grounds that would create a bad climate for the child in the community to be in an interracial marriage. And uh, Florida took custody away from the mother. In 1984. In 1984, and then the Supreme Court reversed it. And you have these issues now with gay adoptions that sim are somewhat, somewhat similar. You think the, the gay adoption issue is closer to I think, I, I, comparable I, I, than... I think it's all going to be allowed, but it's, this is not a very liberal Supreme Court, to put it mildly. To, uh, in fact, although, although this Supreme Court reversed uh, Bow the Bowers case, which had prohibited consensual uh, homosexual relations, and reversed it in Lawrence v. Sanders. And they, they, those five votes are still there. They, they, they could conceivably uh, make, make gay marriages legal.